The new Opel Mokka 2021 has been commissioned to release the front that we will see in future models of the signature of the Ray. We are therefore facing an urban crossover that is renewed externally, with new diesel and gasoline mechanics that join the recently known Mokka e-electric and with the extensive technological equipment typical of the German firm, thus following its current policy of democratization of the premium class. Inside we find two panoramic screens, one of 12 inches that constitutes the instrument panel and another of 7 inches, 10 as an option, for the infotainment system, which has Apple CarPlay and Android Auto connectivity. About equipment, the Germans have placed special emphasis on its abundance and technology, finding it standard with LED headlights, optionally it is possible to equip it with 14 diode matrix, electric parking brake, and signal recognition. Based on a checkbook, it is also possible to have a panoramic rear camera, parking assistant, or adaptive cruise control. On an aesthetic level, it debuts the new front end that Opel will use, with a more dynamic and sporty image articulated in straight horizontal lines to emphasize the width of the set, reminding to some extent of the models of the late 70s and early 80s of the brand. Likewise, the GS Line Sports finish has a two-color exterior, using a black roof and hood also in black, along with inserts that can be red or chrome to separate it from the rest of the body, as well as two-tone wheels, silver, black, and various plastic protections on the wheel arches and on the lower part of the door panels do. At the moment only three thermal mechanics to the already well-known electric version of the Mach-E with 100 kilowatts, 136 horsepower, and 322 kilometers of autonomy, thanks to its 50 kilowatt hours battery, two mechanical gasoline, and one diesel are added. Specifically, we find a 1.2 turbo gasoline 100 horsepower and 136 horsepower, with a six-speed manual transmission and an optional eight for the most powerful. The most interesting thing about these small thrusters is that they deliver 95% of their maximum torque between 1,500 rpm and 3,750 rpm.